Blue skies, dappled sunshine and gentle breezes make one yearn to be outdoors and a picnic is the ideal way of enjoying the warmer weather and spring gardens. We challenged Mela's guest chef Kirti Kamal to come up with something imaginative and she responded with this appetizing menu. Spring is in the air and there's no better way to relax than spending it eating outdoors. Today we'll be sharing three of my favorite picnic recipes. First up, a recipe for a orange and beetroot salad. I got my love of salads from my mum. Growing up, she always made the most wonderful combinations of salads and this recipe I learned from her. The first thing I'm gonna add in are our orange segments and the juice. Some of these chopped dates, which adds a lovely sweetness. Our boiled beetroot, some pepper, a good pinch of salt. And we want all of these salad leaves to be covered in this wonderful orange juice. I only use biodegradable containers and the great thing about these is that you don't have any washing up to do and they don't harm the environment. You want to get in as much lovely bits as you can. Top the salad with some Danish feta, some toasted almonds and some edible flowers. And this is my favorite picnic salad. My next dish is a Vietnamese rice paper wrap. To start, I'm gonna add in some organic cold-pressed coconut oil, some of my veggies. You wanna cook these veggies on a high heat because you wanna keep the texture, yet you want them to be fully cooked all the way through. Add in some pepper and then some salt. I'm going to add in my Vietnamese rice paper wraps into water and these need to soak and get soft. I'm gonna now fill these with our filling. I'm gonna get some veggies and put that in. Add in some mung bean noodles, which are made from lentils. Next, we're gonna get some steamed prawns. We can put about three of these. Now I'm gonna roll up the wrap and it's exactly like you would if you're doing the fried spring roll filling. So we're gonna roll it up on the middle and then take it in on the sides, keeping it as tight as possible. And then just continue to roll it until it's done all the way. So the best way to transport these wraps for a picnic is to use a clean damp cloth and we're gonna put our rice wraps in here. And to go with these rice wraps is this wonderful and pungent Vietnamese dipping sauce. And it's really simple to make. All you need to do is, in a food processor, throw in some chopped coriander, some ginger, some garlic, some sesame seed oil, some lemon juice, and some soy sauce. So to round off our picnic, we're gonna end off with something sweet. This is the perfect spring-inspired dessert because it has floral notes. And to my whipped cream, I'm going to add some rose water. I'm just gonna add in two capfuls. Mix this through so that the flavors incorporate into our softly whipped cream. And I'm gonna begin by assembling our dessert in a glass jar. I'm gonna start with some meringues that I'm gonna put at the bottom of the jar. Next, I'm gonna add in our rose-scented cream. And then I'm gonna add in some sliced strawberries. I'm just gonna continue layering the jar with cream and meringue and strawberries. Some crushed pistachio and an edible flower. There you have it, three spring-inspired picnic recipes. 